Hello everyone, in this video I am going to show how to do student management system project with the help of Python. Here I am using a main two library. The first one is tkinter and the second one is sqlite. The reason why I am using a tkinter is to create a interactable GUI. For that I am using that uh, tkinter library. And here I am using one more library called SQLite. The reason why I am using SQLite is I want to store the student details in database. That's why I am using SQLite uh, library. And I will show how to install that uh, library. First, uh, go to command prompt. Then use this command to install tkinter library. So it says like requirement already satisfied which means i already installed that that's why likewise uh, you need to install that uh, sqlite also i will paste the installation command in description don't forget to install that and now i'm going to run this program so this is the GUI I created with the help of tkinter and the values I am entering here will be stored in a database. I will show example. Um, example, my name is Subash and my college is AHT and my phone number is and my address is This is a sample address. Okay, so here I am going to take input. Take input is nothing but I am storing these values in database. So data saved successfully. That means all the data are stored in database. Now I am going to check what are the data are available in that database. For that I am using display result. So you can see here um, the values I entered are stored in the database and. Uh, I will store one more uh, one more user uh, details. Right. So now I'm going to save another person name. So his name is um, Sagaya. And his college is also AHT. And his phone number is my. Enter, I will enter the random numbers and the address also about 40. I'm not. Here again, I am going to save this user detail so data saved successfully. Now I am going to display the result so you can see um, the values I stored previous also stored in this database. So I will show the database file it's available where i stored my program so this is the database file you can see here database file here only all the entries are uh, stored so that's all about this project if you have any doubt or any queries means please uh, let me know in comment section and keep supporting us thanks for watching thank you